Is your iPhone stuck on the Apple logo and refusing to start up? Don't panic, you're not alone. This issue is quite common, and in most cases, it can be fixed safely without losing your data. In this video, I'll guide you step by step through several effective solutions to help bring your iPhone back to life. Why does this happen? Your iPhone may get stuck on the Apple logo for a few different reasons. The most common cause is a corrupted iOS update or a failed installation that interrupts the system's startup. Sometimes, a software malfunction or a system error can prevent iOS from loading properly. Physical issues like water damage or accidental drops can also interfere with the device's internal components and lead to startup problems. Fortunately, in most cases, these issues can be resolved with a few simple methods before you need to consider professional repair. Method 1. Force Restart Your iPhone Let's start with the simplest fix, a force restart. For iPhone 8 or later, press and quickly release the volume up button, then press and quickly release the volume down button. After that, press and hold the side button until you see the Apple logo appear, then release it. This process can often break the loop and get your iPhone running again. If it starts up normally, you're all set. If not, don't worry. Let's move on to the next method. Method 2. Update or restore using iTunes or Finders. If a force restart doesn't solve the problem, try updating or restoring your iPhone using iTunes on Windows or Finder on a Mac. First, connect your iPhone to the computer and make sure you're using the latest version of iTunes or Makos. Then press and quickly release the volume up button. Press and quickly release the volume down button and hold the side button until the recovery mode screen appears. On your computer, you'll see a prompt asking if you want to update or restore your iPhone. Choose Update first. This will reinstall iOS without erasing your data. If the update doesn't work, repeat the process and choose Restore. But keep in mind that restoring will erase all your data. If this method still doesn't bring your device back, move on to a professional system repair tool. Method 3. Use Rei Boot for standard or deep repair. Tenorshare Rei Boot is a reliable iOS system repair tool that can fix a wide range of issues, including being stuck on the Apple logo, boot loops, or crashes usually without data loss. To use it, download and install Rei Boot on your computer and connect your iPhone using a USB cable. Once the program detects your device, click Enter Recovery Mode to put your iPhone in a safe recovery state. Then choose Standard Repair from the main menu and download the latest firmware package. After the firmware is downloaded, click Start Standard Repair and let the program repair your system. This process may take several minutes, and when it's done, your iPhone should restart normally without losing any data. However, if the standard repair doesn't fix the problem, you can try the Deep Repair option. Deep Repair performs a more complete system restoration, but it will erase all your data, so use it only as a last resort. Method 4. Contact Apple Support. If your iPhone remains stuck on the Apple logo even after trying all these methods, the issue may be hardware-related. Problems such as a faulty logic board, damaged connectors, or water exposure can sometimes cause persistent startup failures. In this case, the best option is to contact Apple Support or visit an authorized Apple Repair Center for professional diagnosis and service. They can check your device thoroughly and offer a repair or replacement if needed. And that's it. These are the safest and most effective ways to fix an iPhone stuck on the Apple logo. Start with the simple methods and work your way up, you'll likely have your phone running again without losing your data. If this video helped you, please like and subscribe. And if you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.